gynecologic oncologist here at Washington University, Seidman Cancer Center. I've been here since 2002. Personalized care, you know, means a lot of things. And when, obviously one is understanding what you need most. And whether that is a lot of information, whether that is really understanding your disease, but a lot of it has to do with how we can understand how best to treat your cancer. As we know, there's not just one type of cancer. Uh, for uterine cancer, there's at least six or eight different types, and then we have to look at how it's staged and how it's spread. All these things really mean that it's not a one-size-fits-all problem. We also have to know, did you have to travel a long ways? Do you have family issues? Do you have child care issues? All these impact your care and help us design a plan that fits you best and also fits the way um, you have to continue to live your life. We understand that. Um, the personalized care also involves the specific molecular features of the cancer, using all the latest tools and techniques to understand how best to treat the, the problem at hand. Because it's always overwhelming when they have their first diagnosis and they're there. Um, they may hear the word cancer and that's all that, that sticks. And uh, so we want to provide people with the resources, reading materials, online materials, for them to really feel comfortable in the decisions that we're helping them make. And again, it is a shared or team process where there are families involved, where the, you know, but the patient really is in charge. Um, I think that we really want to make sure the patients maintain their independence, but have all the information they need to help make decisions. Most rewarding for me is to, to try to strive to have the best outcomes possible to really where our patients can feel that we delivered first class care in a very personal environment is really what's, what's in it for us. Um, we strive to offer the most cutting edge care possible, the newest treatments when they are in fact going to help patients.